How would you push up the infrastructure? We, we, we cannot. We, we cannot. Because obviously, we're, car maker is not going to develop the infrastructure for this. It cannot do that. It's like you're asking car makers to establish a gasoline station in a country to develop cars. It doesn't, it, it doesn't work. Um, what we can is lobby, explain, uh, um, trying to develop tools which are the least expensive, for example, for charging station, the least expensive charging station, and we're doing it. And we're doing it, in fact, collectively in some countries. We're doing it individually from, in other countries. And in fact, communities are doing that. But uh, community, in fact, are allocating budget, are spending money, but it's not going as fast as we'd like it to be. And infrastructure is very important because you're not going to buy an electric car if you have no way, no place where you're going to charge it. You're not going to do that. Uh, so it's a big stumbling block in front of the development of the new technology is a charging station, for example. So infrastructure is extremely important. That's why we developed the technology. That's the first step. But the development of the infrastructure around the technology is also very important. For autonomous cars, it's going to be the same thing, connectivity which goes with autonomous cars, um, it, it require a basic infrastructure to be, uh, to, to be ready. And for this, we're going to need countries or cities to step up. That's why this association that we mentioned today, where we're going to be working with the 100 resilient cities. 100 resilient cities, uh, I've seen the list of the, city, of the cities. It's amazing. I mean, you have Paris, you have New York, you have Miami, uh, you have Biblos in Lebanon, you have, I mean, I mean you have a lot of, uh, you know, forward things. You have a lot of Japanese uh, uh, cities. We don't have Tokyo, which was surprised. Koike-san did not still jump on, on this one. Um, you have a lot of cities saying, help us build you know, the infrastructure necessary in order to face the necessity of transportation for the, for the future. This is one of the reasons we are very interested into collaborating with this kind of uh, NGO um, and cities to try with them to work, put the technology, explain what are the conditions for developing a resilient transportation. Many Spanish cities also. Huh? Thank you. One? Barcelona, yeah. Uh, Barcelona, yeah. <laughs>